Well, good afternoon, guys. Bracco here. Um, please hit that thumbs up, subscribe, and share. Now, I decided to do a video on the recent story. I think it was a couple days ago. There was a, another arrest because of the John Durham investigation. And this guy, by the name of Danchenko, who's a Russian guy who apparently lives, was living in Virginia at the time, um, he is a possible resource that's connected to the Steele dossier. Maybe the Russian resource, of course, the questionable information that was provided for the Steele dossier about Trump's supposed Russian escapades in the hotel. Well, anyways, this guy was a target by John Durham, and he was arrested, indicted on five counts of lying to the FBI. So let's connect the whole dots here. We have the FBI attorney who faked emails to use that to get FISA warrants to spy on Trump and his campaign. He went down, Mr. Kleinsmith, who, in my opinion, is still just a minnow in the pond. But then Michael Sussman, who's a former attorney for Perkins Coy, who is connected to Clinton. Well, he went down, still, still maybe a little bit bigger than a minnow, but still not a big fish. And now we got Danchenko. Danchenko used to work at the Brookings Institute, which the former president of the Brookings Institute is a friend of Bill Clinton's. So, wow, connect the dots. All these dots are leading back to where? Clinton. Well, we know how that goes, right? The big fish have not been caught yet. Are the big fish about to be caught? Well, I guess we're going to wait and see about that. I'm going to keep following this story because it's a real intrigue thing to me. And um, I just figured I'd share that with you guys. I hope you liked the video. If you'd like to hear more information about this, please put it in the comments. And until my next video, I'll talk to you later.